So you bought a tank and thought it was a propane, but it was butane. Yeah. So we're going straight for a ways, yeah, right? Straight. If you ever, if you're out in the country and you want to get a, a tank, I'll never, well, check the working PSI on the label. It's, it's under 200, it says 200, it's a butane tank. It's got to say 250 to be in uh, propane. propane. But you, propane is what you use to cook on, though. Yeah, that's what it used to be. People did use butane to cook with, but they never do anymore. It's plastics manufacturers use that butane. So, uh, propane is the only one that's used for cooking now. And, uh, butane being a heavier molecule uh, composed of four carbon atoms, more, more viscous, therefore it, 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 uh, it's more liquid, it doesn't require as much pressure to contain it. Propane only has three carbon atoms per uh, molecule, so therefore it, uh, it's more gas. So which is better to cook with? Well... Straight? Yeah, straight. Probably they're the same, it's just that... You can get more butane in a tank? You probably could get more butane in a tank, yeah. Probably could. But it doesn't require as much pressure. If you had a butane leak, it wouldn't probably be as... As severe as a propane leak. Because it would leak slower. Yeah. Well, propane's a bomb. Uh -huh. Propane is a bomb. I think you can't... Yeah, yeah. You, unless the tank's a certain age, they won't fill it, right? Right. We got an older tank, we're gonna take it out of Mexico, they'll fill anything down there. <laughs> okay, we'll be on the left. Okay, well, there's the I'm looking for the ARC, I didn't think it was this far. Damn. Pflugerville High School. Yeah. Well, look at that football stadium they got there. My god, it's like a college man. I'm looking for Windermere, and I don't understand why... Okay, now we're getting close to town. I don't know what the problem is. I guess we got to turn around again. Oh, man, we're going know. the wrong way here? Yeah, we're past... Uh... If you see a sign that says Windermere, that's the street we're looking for. And I don't know why I'm not finding it. Okay, so we're on 